Good preparation and job site organization are key to an efficient and high quality build. Footings poured to within one quarter inch of level will make the job much easier. When pouring footings, trowel the edges smooth where track will be laid. Clean excess concrete from around cleats that may obstruct the track. Use a laser level to confirm accuracy of the footings. Note variation on the footing with a felt pen or crayon. Ensure that footing dowels are installed per plan. Dedicate one or two crew members to pre-assemble forms or buckouts for all door and window openings, while others clear excess building materials and debris from the ICF assembly area. Mark the exact position of each window and door opening on the footing and note the sill height for installation. Minimize assembly time by pre-positioning corner brackets and pre-bent corner rebar at each corner and pre-cut horizontal rebar positioned along the footing. Place panels and ties within easy reach around the entire build area. Set up a cutting station in the center of the build where a dedicated crew member can supply cut panels to others as needed. Note exact wall elevations and plan how to achieve them with ICF panels by cutting the first or last course to shorter height. For example, a 9 foot 3 inch finished wall can begin with a quad lock panel ripped to 3 inches. Pre-plan access points for utilities and services. Install sleeves through walls where necessary prior to pouring concrete. Make sure that bracing equipment is on site or ensure there is adequate lumber on hand if wood bracing is needed.